Well, good day. This is going to be how to put a Vokey onto your web page. Now, a Vokey is like this little kid here. Look, you can look up and he can look down. That's pretty good. And he can talk. Let's see if he can talk. Let me check. Well, good day. This is Mr. Lyshenko. Well, wow, that is really loud. Well, anyway, this is a little Vokey, and you can make one too. And not only can you make one, but you can put it on your wiki page. First thing you have to do is go to the wiki page. Then, when you go to the wiki page, make sure you're logged in. Make sure it's your name up there. And if it's not your name, if it's somebody like Strawberry or something, then you're going to have to log out because you are not Strawberry. Then, after you log out, of course, you log right back in with your real secret identity. Once you got logged in, then go to your web page. And so mine's right here. Then I go down here. Now I'm going to put my Vokey here on this web page. So I got to edit this page. So I go to edit. And I'm going to put the Vokey at the bottom. I think we should just put stuff at the bottom. I'm going to look at the source data here. Look at the source code. And it's got all this very strange source code stuff in there. And we don't really need to know all about that. But we can go down to the bottom right here. And then let's just do enter, enter, enter. And we'll be on a clean, fresh line. And this, this is where we're going to put our Vokey. So let's go out to a new tab up here at the top. We're going to leave the wiki for a minute. We're going out to the new tab, and we're heading to the Vokey.com. V-O-K-I dot com. There, you see that? Go. Now, Vokey is a place you have to log into. You have to log in using the using an email address. And so I'm going to do log in. I'm going to put in our email address. Here we go. See that? Then I'm going to put in our secret password that nobody knows. Login. You can't make a Vokey unless you have an email address. Now, if you have a real email address, you should use your real email address. Go ahead and just go ahead and use it. So I made a Vokey, and here it is, and I made sure I named it something unique. Now, you should name yours after your secret identity. Don't name yours Mr. Lushenko. That's not right. Here's a little Vokey I made. Let's hear it. Let's hear it go. Hi. This is Rocky Raccoon. Oh, man, that is really loud. All right. So anyway, we're going to create a new Vokey. Here you go. Look, create a new Vokey. And here we go. This is it. Now, there's three main things you can change. You can change your character. You can change the background, and then you can change the player. So you can customize your character. Let's do that first. So you choose a character, and there's just all kind of characters you can change. I don't even know how many there are. There's just lots of them, and you can say, I want animals. No. Maybe I want these crazy, edgy guys. No. Then maybe I want these oddballs. Uh, maybe I do. Oh, look. Some of them you could change their hair, and you could change their lips, and you can even change other stuff. So I'm going to think uh, maybe this one looks like me or something. I think the, yeah, okay, this is right. Hey, I look just like that. Okay, so then you can change their hair. You say, wait a minute, I'm gonna, what kind of hair choices do I have? Oh, look, you can make her hair like this, or you can make the hair like this, or you can make the hair like this. So there's just so many choices. Then you can change your mouth, too. You say, okay, I'm going to change the mouth. Oh, not very many choices. I can do this choice. I can do this choice. I think I'm going to stay with that. But now you see she's got some sort of like little green dress on. But you could change the clothing. And you say, I'm going to make her look like maybe like this one. Or maybe like this one. Or maybe like this one. And Oh, there's just all kind of choices. And, oh, oh, look at this. Costumes. You can put her in a costume. You say, well, maybe I'm going to make her look like this. So maybe this is a good one. Or maybe like this. Whichever one you want, it doesn't matter. So uh, you choose the one you like. So you might even, ooh, look, bling, bling. Let's try that and see what that is. You could change, you could put her, oh, put glasses on her. Maybe these are the right glasses. Or these are the right glasses. 
or maybe these are the right glasses. Or you look, you can just say no glasses, forget the glasses idea. But you could, oh look, jewelry, jewelry, let's give it a choice. Oh, they have a few choices on this one. Now every character is a little bit different. I mean, if you had a different character, you wouldn't have these choices. So you got to fool around with it and say, do you want this, or maybe you want this, or maybe you want this, or whatever you want. Yeah, and change it around. Okay. Oh, look at this. Looks like she can have some sort of extras on the edge. Oh, look at this. Maybe she's got tennis. Let's see if it, tennis does anything. Mm, I couldn't see anything. What about this? Oh, she's got a little balloon. That's cute. Maybe a car. Can I see a car? Oh, she's got a car in the back. What about she plays the drums? Maybe I don't care, so I'll change it to nothing. Okay, anyway, this was all about the character. Then I'll say I'm done. Now, character was just one part. Now you can change the backgrounds. So there's all kind of backgrounds to change. I can't even tell you how many backgrounds there are. So you pick the one you like. I don't even know which one you like. So pick one out. Maybe that's a good one. Then say, okay, I'm done. Lastly, after you do the character and after you do the background, you can do a player. Now that's the outside, right? Here we go players let's go see what it does players it says well you got nine choices you want blue okay I give you blue you want uh, what is that magenta or something maybe this one's red you think whichever one you want I don't know which one you want which one do you want I don't even know so I'm gonna say okay that's good enough I'm gonna say done well now you gotta give your wiki some sort of voice and what you could do is click this microphone and then you could click record and then you can record your voice or whatever you want to do or, instead of that, you could type it in and have the computer do it for you. Watch this. I'll do this one just as an example. And uh, this one looks pretty good to me. Let's play it and see if we can hear it, see if it works. Hello, this is Mr. Lushenko. This is where I'll store my work for all the world to see. Hey, that looks great to me. So I'll say done. Now, I think I'm ready to go. I'm going to publish. I, I did all my things. I did the character. I did the background. I did the players. I gave it a voice. I could use the microphone, but today I used the uh, text to speech, and now I'm going to publish. I'll go down here to publish. Okay, so what do you want to call it? Now, this is important. You've got to give it your secret identity name. So I'm going to call mine Rocky Raccoon. And you give it your secret name. And then I'll say, okay, save it. Save it. That seems right. Hey, look at that. Your scene has been saved. I'll give it a close. Now, oh, look, look, here's the code. This is the code if you want it to be a medium size. And you could change it. Well, I wouldn't do that, though. You can make it small or you can make it large. But let's just stick with medium and try it out. So I go down here. I'm going to click on this uh, code stuff here. And i got to, like, highlight the whole thing. So I click it once, like this. Then I'm going to do Control-A. That is, I'm going to hold down the Control key on the keyboard, hold down the Control key on the keyboard, and then tap the A. A for all. Now it's all blue. And I'm going to copy this blue stuff, not the white stuff over here, this blue stuff. So you got to point it to blue stuff, give it a right click, and what do we do? Oh yeah, we copy it. So we go to copy. Now we got to go back to our wiki page and paste it in. So I go over here to my wiki page. I'm still on the source. Remember that? We did the source thing to look around. I'm going to paste it at the very bottom. Give it a right click and paste. Here you go. Paste it right there. That looks pretty good. Oh, look at that. I put all that stuff in there. Who knows what that all means? It's all crazy stuff. We don't know. Then we do save. Save seems right. We'll do save. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. Look at that. My Vokey is working. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe it. Let me play it and see if it plays. We'll try it out. Hello, this is Mr. Lushenko. This is where I'll store my work for all the world to see. Hey, fantastic. That's about all there is to it.